I know it means so much to everyone out here and it took a lot for all of us to come back and um, it's my senior year and I had to redshirt my junior year. So I was really nervous of having a COVID tennis season my senior year, but we're all looking forward to it and we're really pumped. I think a big part of a team sport is being able to get along and love each other like we do. And uh, we have a new freshman, Abby, and she's been a perfect addition to our team and um, we're really lucky. I just think that, um, I don't know, the start of the tournament this past weekend, it um, made me realize like I have a lot of experience and I hope that throughout the season I can give it to the younger girls. I know we're all really excited and um, it's going to take, we're going to have to work really hard, but um, I know we have a team full of fighters and we're just going to go out there and uh, fight and have fun and see what happens. I think it changes your perspective on everything. Uh, being able to not finish the season sort of recalibrates a little bit about why you're, I'm doing what I'm doing and why I am coaching. Um, it truly is for the development of young student athletes um, in their walk with Christ and in their you know, future endeavors outside of Southeastern. Um, we love to compete and it's such a blessing to be able to compete again. Um, but I think having the time off, it totally re-perspectives of what's the most important things for us as a program. I think, you know, we miss out on having a lot of our ladies here in the fall um, due to travel restrictions uh, through the pandemic. Um, so I think having everybody back now has just been one obstacle just to get everybody here. But I think it's a testimony to them and their willingness to compete and wanting to be part of this program is finding ways to be able to get here. Um, in some instances, we've had to have student athletes go to Mexico and quarantine for two weeks so that they're able to then travel into the United States. So going through those extra measures, it really shows you how committed and uh, how much of a desire there is to compete and play. I think for sure. I think the one new lady we brought on is Abigail Damon. And she's awesome. And she was able to be here in the fall. So we were able to get her right into our program and doing things. And, and she's been awesome. Everyone else has been part of the program before. So maybe if they had to come a little bit later, um, it was not hard to get acclimated extremely quick into what we want to do and the culture we're trying to build and into competing as well. There's two ways to look at it, right? I, but I, I'm going to think of it positively, uh, starting out with such a huge conference match right away. I think they're probably just as prepared as we are um, in terms of it's one of their first matches as well. So I think we're excited and we're excited to be playing at home um, and being able just honestly just the opportunity to step on the court and compete and give it our all. We'll be ready uh, and we're excited to get it going.